Welcome to the Pop Up Law series. Justice Arvind Kumar, sitting judge of Supreme Court of India, on 7th April 2023, proposed the use of artificial intelligence to reduce the pendency of cases, particularly motor vehicle accident cases, which are the highest pendent cases in the country currently. On 31st December 2022, Law Minister Kiran Rijiju stated that pending cases across various courts in the country were moving towards the 5 crore mark with an over 4.32 crore backlog in the subordinate courts according to the data shared by the government in Rajya Sabha. Citing details available on the Supreme Court website, Mr. Rijiju said that 69,511 cases were pending in the top court as on 1st February. He further quoted, 59,87,477 cases are pending in the high courts across the country as per the information available on National Judicial Data Grid on 1st February 2023. Adding further, the law minister stated that 10.30 lakh cases were pending in the Allahabad High Court, making it the highest in the country, whereas with only 171 cases at the Sikkim High Court, making it the least number of pending cases. With this, the total pending cases came to over 4.92 crores. Justice Arvind Kumar, when he was Chief Justice of Gujarat High Court and Judge of Karnataka High Court, took the initiative to conceptualize the program of using AI for a speedy recovery of motor vehicle accidents in Gujarat. And on being elevated as Judge of Supreme Court on 13th February, he told the Registrar of Information Technology Wing of Gujarat High Court to accomplish it. Justice Kumar advocated that a necessary program is required to determine the compensation for fractures and injuries involving motor vehicle accidents which can be devised using AI and can do wonders in expeditiously disposing of cases saving time and money so let's understand very briefly about artificial intelligence John McCarthy considered to have invented the term artificial intelligence gave to AI in 1956 He described AI as allowing a machine to behave in such a way that it would be called intelligent if a human being behaved in such a way. Artificial intelligence is simply developing a machine to think and to act like a human mind using machine learning. The computer has to learn how to respond to certain actions, so it uses algorithms and historical data to create something called a propensity model. It has been argued that use of AI would make it fairer and speedier since unlike human judges AI does not get tired and does not depend on its glucose level to function since not all court work is complex and custom work therefore the need for information technology is not the same for all the cases AI which is after all also information technology can therefore be useful in different ways for different types of cases On 6th April 2021 the Supreme Court of India inaugurated its first AI portal called Supreme Court Portal for assistance in court efficiency which is expected to reduce the workload of the judges the Supac portal was launched as a pilot in the Bombay and Delhi high courts dealing with criminal matters and a committee was also established for exploring the ways in which AI can be used to tackle motor accident claim tribunals kindly let us know your views on it And to know more please click the link below